CNN, updated, May 25, 2018, 1033 IST BJP's five-time MLA from Rajahinagar S. Suresh Kumar has filed his nomination for the post of Speaker. With 104 members in its ranks BJP stands no chance of winning the post unless 14 members from Congress and JDS cross vote for Suresh. Senior BJP leader leader, former Minister S. Suresh Kumar at Cop Manid filed his nominations for Speaker's post. Read more of Bengaluru, BJP sprang a surprise on Thursday by deciding to contest Friday's election for the post of Speaker, lending an interesting twist to the trust vote to be sought by Chief Minister H.D. Kumaraswamy later in the day. Acting on directions from party bosses in New Delhi, BJP's five-time MLA from Rajahinagar S. Suresh Kumar filed his nomination on Thursday forcing an election for the Speaker's post for the first time ever in Karnataka. There is, however, the possibility of him pulling back from the contest just as Yeti Yerapa did on Saturday when faced with a floor test and inadequate numbers. The House is slated to assemble at 12.15 p.m. on Friday and immediately take up the election of the Speaker. With 104 members in its ranks BJP stands no chance of winning the post unless 14 members from Congress and JDS cross vote for Suresh. Given that both parties are closely guarding their flock, a cross vote is highly unlikely. We know we don't have the numbers to win the Speaker's post but we want to register our protest against the unholy alliance between Congress and JDS by contesting the election and expose the opportunistic politics of the two parties, said BJP MLA and party spokesperson C.T. Ravi. It's being said that BJP will boycott the trust vote after the Speaker's election. Congress, on the other hand, has cited precedents and appealed to BJP to allow the Speaker to be elected unanimously. The Speaker's post is a non-political and constitutional post. He belongs to no party. So I appeal to BJP MLAs to elect our nominee K.R. Ramesh Kumar unanimously, said Deputy Chief Minister G. Parameshwara. Ramesh Kumar, MLA from Srinivasapur, is a former minister and speaker. Alleging that BJP is still trying to poach Congress and JDS MLAs, Parameshwara said, I have been receiving calls that some Congress MLAs are being lured. But none of our MLAs will fall prey to this. They are all united. I am confident that we will pass the floor test. All set for floor test Chief Minister H.D. Kumaraswamy is all set to take the floor test on Friday and confident of sailing through. The atmosphere remained rather calm on the eve of the trust vote with Congress J.D. as confident of the verdict and BJP resigned to it. Both Congress and J.D.S. held their respective legislature party meetings and instructed MLAs on their role in the floor test. Both parties are expected to issue whips to bind MLAs to their decision. Get latest news. Download the Times of India news app for your device. Read more city news in English and other languages. Related Toyota Prius get off Rob Key Policy Genius Ling International Day 1, HD Kumaraswamy stays away from office, visits 3 months 14 held for Bengaluru lynching, here psychosis grips Karnataka private schools still admitting older children to class 1.